14 Endangered Sea Creatures. Welcome to Deep Sea Sunday. Number 14. Crinoid Snapping Shrimp. As you can likely tell by its name, this creature belongs to a species of snapping shrimp, but it's the only one that is endangered. They're also known as a pistol shrimp because it makes a loud cracking and shooting noise. Now it actually shoots air, but the pistol effect is strong enough to stun prey that happens to swim past. These shrimp measure about one centimeter and live off of the mucus of sea creatures called feather stars, also known as crinoids. Its major threat is reef destruction. Number 13, sockeye salmon. It's the third most common species of salmon in the Pacific Ocean and migrates from the sea to freshwater to spawn. Their breeding process can be difficult because they lay eggs in the river then return to the sea and both the river and the sea are necessary to culture salmon. These fish are prized for their raw meat which is served as sashimi. Once they're caught their life cycle is shortened and the species can't reproduce if they have no chance to lay millions of eggs. They are listed under the U.S. Endangered Species Act. Number 12. Napoleon Ras. This huge, colorful fish is found in the Western Pacific Ocean and in the Indian Ocean. Unfortunately, its amazing coloration makes it desirable as a luxury fish in Asia and was once eaten by royalty. Major consumers of the fish today include China, Singapore, and Malaysia, and it's also imported illegally from the Philippines. Other factors contributing to its declining numbers include habitat loss and illegal fishing activities. Number 11, Stella sea lion. It's the largest of the eared seals, only the walrus and elephant seals are larger. They've been hunted for their meat since prehistoric times, and their skin was used for clothing and boating material. The western stock of Stella sea lions was listed as endangered after populations fell up to 80% since the 1970s. Among the causes for that severe decline is the overfishing of pollock, herring, and other fish in the Gulf of Alaska that the sea lions feed on. Shooting by fishermen and climate change are some of the other factors cited. Number 10. Scalloped Hammerhead Shark. You can likely identify this animal by the unique shape of its head, and they use that noggin as a weapon when hunting prey. It lives in warm and tropical coastal waters around the world and is listed as globally endangered. In the Atlantic Ocean, the populations have declined by more than 95% over the past three decades. Overfishing and a demand for shark fins are among the reasons for those shrinking numbers. Hammerheads are among the sharks most commonly caught for finning. That's the practice of shearing off the animal's fins and then throwing the rest of the shark back into the water to die. Number 9. Florida manatee. Manatees are related to dugongs, and although they do look alike, a difference can be found in the tails. A manatee has a circular tail, while the dugongs is crescent-shaped. Manatees are threatened by climate change, which causes the temperatures in their native warm waters to fluctuate. The creatures are also threatened by the presence of boats. The propellers can injure the slow-moving manatees who cannot always avoid the incoming vessels. Did you know manatees actually are related to elephants? The two animals shared a common ancestor that died more than 50 million years ago. Number 8 green sea turtles. There is a global trade in sea turtle meat and turtle products, and that serves to endanger these creatures. Some of the animals are caught and killed at young ages, then dried and varnished to be sold as curio items. The animals are also poached for the shells, which can fetch steep prices. The reason that green sea turtles are named as such is because they eat only green seagrass and seaweeds. They also have a layer of green-colored fats under the shells. Number 7. Borneo Shark. Sharks are mercilessly hunted for the meat and for the fins, which is considered a delicacy. Borneo sharks have been listed as endangered by the International Union of Conservation of Nature. These are often considered the rarest of all sharks and only inhabit misty rivers. The small creatures measure around 26 inches long, and the only confirmed specimens were found in 1937 and 2004. Number 6. Fin whales. This is the second largest animal after the blue whale. 
and it's found from polar to tropical waters. As with other large whales, this animal was hunted heavily throughout the 20th century and is considered an endangered species. Even though the International Whaling Commission issued a moratorium on the commercial hunting of this whale, Japan and Iceland have resumed hunting activities. Global estimates for the population range from under 100,000 to around 119,000 individuals. Asian stocks of the fin whale are considered critically endangered. Number 5. Hawksbill Sea Turtle While it resembles other marine turtles, this animal is clearly distinguished by its curved, sharp beak and serrated appearance of its shell margins. They spend more time in tropical coral reefs and shallow lagoons in addition to living in the open ocean. They've been eaten as delicacies in China since the 5th century BC, and the shells are used for decorative purposes, and it is the basis of the material tortoise shell. The turtle's critically endangered status is due to a loss of habitat because of pollution and coastal development, among other factors. Number 4. Whale Shark Discovered in 1828 off the coast of South Africa, it's considered to be the biggest fish species in the world, reaching a confirmed length of 41 and a half feet and weighing some 47,000 pounds. It's found in tropical waters and is considered endangered due to the impact of fisheries, vessel strikes, and bycatch losses. And because the animals can live to around 70 years, their late maturation means it takes more time to repopulate the losses. Currently, there is no agreed-upon estimate of the global whale shark population. Number 3. Irrawaddy Dolphins These creatures are related to the orca, or killer whales, and is similar in appearance to the beluga. It's found near sea coasts and in rivers in areas of the Bay of Bengal and Southeast Asia. They're considered more susceptible to human conflict than dolphins that live farther in the open ocean. Noise pollution from high-speed vessels is considered a threat to these animals because it makes them dive for extended periods of time. But accidental capture and drowning in gill nets present a greater risk for the creatures. The internet the National Union for Conservation of Nature lists five out of seven subpopulations as critically endangered, due primarily to the risk of drowning in fishing nets. Number two. Axolotl. It's also known as a Mexican walking fish. Despite that name, it's actually an amphibian, and they're used extensively in scientific research due to their ability to regenerate their limbs. The creature is native only to lakes of central Mexico and is listed as a critically endangered species in the wild, with a population that's decreasing. Water pollution from the urbanization of Mexico City is cited as a major threat to the axolotl. Likewise, the introduction of non-native fish such as Asian which prey on the amphibians. As of 2010, axolotls in the wild were considered near extinct. Number 1. Vaquita porpoises. This rare species of small porpoise is native to the northern region of the Gulf of California and is considered to be the world's most endangered cetacean. While they've never been hunted directly, a major reason for their decline is the use of illegal gill nets. That's a type of netting that catches fish by the gills and prevents their escape. The vaquita are not always the target for gill nets, but they become ensnared all the same. In 2014, the estimated number of individuals was less than 100. By 2016, that number was down to 60. Unless greater conservation efforts are undertaken, it's speculated that this species could become extinct within five years' time. Thank <laughs> you.